Are you sick and tired of keeping track of those staking rewards? Or even the slow and painful drip of those LP payouts that could even be in multiple tokens? And do you wish you could just restack it all for an even juicier return without having to sit down at your computer multiple times a day? Maybe you even dream of having a sexy deck, limit order, or stop odds feature? On Polkadot, you can do all of it and more. It's Seasane here, and this week we're going to take a look at Oat Network, Polkadot's connoisseur of on-chain automation. Automation is a story, one that resonates in today's society of Uber, Netflix, Postmates, and Amazon, and Oak is bringing that convenience to the doorstep of DeFi. Maybe you're thinking, what exactly makes automation so special? Well, sir, let me count the ways. Oak is currently experimenting with their automation solutions over on Kusama's Turing network with Yield Boost, the on-chain auto-compounding feature that lets you turn your APR into APY in just one click, since it's baked right into the runtime a Polkadot-only feature. Imagine incorporating scheduled payments to DAO members, multi-step automated tasks, auto dollar cost averaging, and more, all without exposing your keys or relying on a centralized exchange. Only possible on Polkadot, Oak and Turing will soon be incorporating those automation solutions through those ultra-secure channels between DOT and KSM secured chains. Parallel, Fala, Akala, Mangata X, Bifrost, and Crust. And this is just the beginning, as chads like Hoon from Astar are already thinking up wild ideas on how to make these automation solutions work between chain. But do you think their tokenomics will hold the test of time? The token distribution shows pretty normal allocations for a Polkadot parachain. It is worth noting that the allocations for funding rounds, which make up 31% of the total allocations, are on the lower side compared to competitors. The token release schedule is not linearly vested as usual. Instead, tokens will be released on fixed dates, creating multiple sharp increases in supply. The accumulative unlock chart paints an interesting picture. Although in the second year, a substantial amount of tokens will be released, there are multiple spikes in the circulating token supply in the first year, which could lead to volatility in the market as circulating supply is still on the lower side at this point. With the big token releases in the second year, the price can afterwards stabilize through deeper liquidity available, which is to be welcomed by users. The Oak token will be inflationary four years after GG, until the deflationary phase will kick in. Supply will slowly decrease at a dynamic rate at this point. In dire times like the current ones, it is a big peace of mind for a project when they have solid funding. Oak raised $5.5 million in early 2022 and aims to raise another $4.5 million in the near future, which will give the Oak team 36 months of runway. The Oak team expects to be cash flow positive at the end of 23. Doing so, they need to capture all of the estimated 60,000 cross-chain automation and transaction on Polkadot per month. You missed the crowd loan? The Oak token will come with the help of a leading market maker to a tier one exchange near you in early 23.